Well, Massachusetts delegates are in a bit of limbo given President Biden's departure from the race. 116 delegates are still headed to Chicago next month for the DNC. But what happens is anyone's guess right now. Our NBC 10's John Maroney joining us live from the State House with a look at what's next, John. Priscilla, this is uncharted territory forcing delegates to the DNC to come up with a new game plan. Now that Joe Biden has officially dropped out, I see the Democratic Party as more unified than it has been this entire election cycle. Bound for Cornell in the fall, 18-year-old Ella Hogan has been released from her pledge to support Joe Biden, turning instead to Kamala Harris for her first convention as a delegate. To be able to cast my vote as a delegate for the first woman of color nominee for president of the United States is just an immense honor. The president's move to step aside and endorse his vice president has changed the equation. Delegates are free to pick another candidate with their convention set for next month in Chicago. I've talked to nearly 100 of our delegates uh, of the 116, and I'm yet to meet one who's not supporting Kamala Harris. Steve Kerrigan is head of the state's Democratic Party, which he says will follow the lead of delegates regarding an endorsement. At the national level, he says the DNC is working on convention details and whether a vote on the nomination will take place virtually beforehand. The leaders on the Rules Committee and others of the DNC are working to make sure ballot access is guaranteed for our nominees, and that may require a virtual vote. There should be a, a traditional convention where people get to vote in person by name. A delegate to the convention, Secretary of State Bill Galvin, says he opposes a virtual vote, but says the end result will be the same. As every hour goes by, the likelihood that there's going to be a challenge to Kamala Harris evaporates. She will be the nominee. Now, the Secretary of State says that that change at the top of the ticket will not impact the ballot here in Massachusetts in November. As far as those delegates going to the DNC, they're meeting tonight to try to figure out what is next. Well, I'm in Boston, John Maroney, NBC 10 Boston.